morning. It is quarter to eight. We've had our breakfast. We're up, ready. This one's awake. Can you believe it? He's awake before 10 o'clock. <laughs> no, before like half at nine. We are off to Misan today. So we're going to just go downstairs and wait for our bus. It should be here between quarter to eight and quarter past eight. So we're going to go down now. It is a lovely sunny morning now, but I have just checked the weather and it says 100% chance of rain all day from like nine o'clock. Hopefully it doesn't, otherwise that one kind of ruined going to Misan. The bus is here, it's about half past eight, it's very late and it's a little bit, it wasn't, it's full. So we're just waiting here, a big bus is going to come and we're going to switch over to a big bus. There's no seats for us in that one. I think here's the big bus for us. Where are you going? On the way back to Koyan, return Koyan. Very good bus. High class, not sorry bus. Only came about three in Pusano and Barama. Four and three. Two four summer from Barry Demis, Rodic Joyce, by a American bomb in the 1969. A last of American bomb, the rock in my son. We arrived at Misun, it took about an hour. By the time we actually got going, it took much longer than that. By the time we faffed around collecting people and whatever, but about an hour once we got going. So we've got to take a little shuttle to the site, a little electric car thing. I would like to introduce the plan of the Mason release to you for the map, the map, <coughs> the map. And uh, on the way come here, I tell you, in Mason today only 20 temple around here, before 70. So we've just been at the first site. The man's given us those, like information about it and everything. We've just got like 10 minutes so we can have a little look around by ourselves, take some pictures and stuff. I'm so annoyed, I brought my drone to try and get some cool aerial shots and I just was getting it out and the security man told me I'm not allowed to fly it. So that's annoying. It is such an incredibly boiling warm day today. We actually um, quite fancy a little bit of rain to be honest. We're never happy are we? When it's raining we want sun, when it's sunny we want rain. Three huge bomb craters from the from the war. This is one over here. Full of water. So that's the bomb crater from the um, the Vietnam War. 
or the American War, if you're Vietnamese, I suppose. I'm assuming, yeah, that one's been restored, hasn't it? Yeah. Here's another bomb crater. Whoa. I did, to be honest. This is the uh, third bomb crater. There's actually a few more, I think. I think there's one just there as well. Like right next to each other, bomb craters. Yeah. I think that's our tour kind of done. We're just heading back through, I think. Our tour guide is an absolute nutcase. Isn't he crazy? Yeah. <laughs> He's absolutely up his head. <laughs> I think we're, yeah, we're heading back to uh, get one of those electric cars, I think. Back to the bus. Apparently we're going the romantic The romantic way. way. Yeah, he said we're going the romantic way. I don't know what that means. No, me neither. Apart from the playing the song. Oh yeah, he said something about music, didn't he? Melody. Melody, yeah. I take back my statement about there being three bomb, sh um, bomb shelters. Yeah, bomb, um, what am I called? Bomb craters. There's absolutely loads of them. There's another one. Just there. It was obviously a heavily bombed area during the war. Oh my goodness, there's another one here as well, this one's huge. This one's got a little bit of water in. Wow. Yeah, so that obviously the um, the ruins weren't as ruined before the war. They've been heavily damaged during the war, which is a shame. Yeah, it was huge, wasn't it? Went right past us. Right, we're all done. We're back on the... Uh... Hello. Oh, hello. hello. <laughs> oh, we're back on the electric cars. Going back. Water, oh, thank you. Oh, free water. Oh, that's nice. Thank you. Oh. Back on the bus. Free bottle of water, very much needed. Back to the hotel. We got back to the hotel and I didn't go running this morning because we had to leave early. And oh, I'm gonna have to go now. I still can't bother. I was sitting there doing some work and I was like, I need to go run in and I'm like, no, I'll go later. I was like, no, go now, otherwise I'm definitely not gonna go later. I can't really, I can't cope. I have to go first thing, otherwise it just, it, no. But I promised myself that I was gonna go every day in November. And I'm not gonna miss out on doing it today, so I'm gonna go for a quick run and also nip to the shop as well. Stephen's obviously gonna stay here. So I'll see you when I go back. I'll be all red faced and sweaty, probably. So I haven't got a big red face because it is hours after I went for my run. <laughs> Hang on a second. Um, yeah, it's hours afterwards. We have just been in the room. I've been working. Stephen was watching um, Hunger Games at Mark and Jay Part 1. And I said, after that finishes, we'll go out. But as you start it's finished, it's flashed up saying Mark and Jay Part 2 is coming on. So it's like, oh, Part 2, I need to watch that. So I've just skipped out to the shop to get some supplies. And we're going to stay in for a little bit longer. Watch Mock and Jay 2 and then um, and then we're gonna head out because it's our last night in Hoi An so definitely need to go and have a little wander around, maybe go for a drink somewhere or whatever. It's a nice evening. It looks like just over there, I can't really see it because it's behind the buildings. It looks like it might be a nice little sunset over there. It's all like I can just see a little bit of red sky. I missed it. Never mind. There'll be another one tomorrow. Actually, I'll be on the bus tomorrow. We've got to book the over. I've booked the overnight bus to Nutang. So, I'll be on the bus tomorrow night. It's me. Let me in. You okay? Oh, it's cold in here. Mock and Jay started? No. Not yet. I'm so cold. The aircon's been on for hours and I'm like, <laughs> I'm freezing cold, I need to get outside in the warm. We're heading back out now. I think we're going to go for some tea or something. Not entirely sure. We have a lizard in our room, by the way. We were just sat before on the bed and it ran behind the telly. It just was like all of a sudden, it was just be down there and it just shot up behind the telly. I'm pretty sure it's probably not behind the telly anymore, but we don't know where it is. Like, I'm so cold, I'm like, literally, ready to go outside, get in the wall. I don't think we've ever been out so late, it's 8 o'clock, and everything's all, like, all the shops are closed and everything, and it's like, quiet, it's just quiet, it's, it's 
It's really quiet, isn't it? I think we are gonna eat out tonight. We are trying to not eat out generally because saving the monies, but it's our last night in Hoi An, so we're gonna pick the favouritest place that we've been to, and then we're gonna go there and have a little meal, I think. Well, when I said it was really quiet, that's because nobody's down there. They're all up here by the river. It is heaving down here at this time of night. I can't believe we've not been out with this. Oh, they're playing one of those games, I think. Yeah, they are. Like a, a special car game thing where we learned about it when we were in... I can't remember where we were. But they, um, they have like 10 seats or something and then they all they sit in seats and play this card game. There's a big uh, like match going on. This is what I'm talking about. There's like maybe eight or ten like little things that you sit on. You sit on them pairs and you play this special card game. Vintage, it's like a big competition. It's just got kind of Vietnamese thing. It's a bit naughty of us to do this, but we have come back to the pizza place that we came. This place here. If you ever come to Hoi An and you fancy pizza, Casa Italia. It's not focusing. Casa Italia is kind of on the front here but the pizzas honestly are absolutely delicious they're, they're done in like a wood burner and they're so so nice if you do fancy a pizza if you want to fancy a break from all the vietnamese food not that we've been eating much vietnamese food but if you do fancy a break from it this place is amazing how nice do these look they've just arrived we're just doing a little um cash royale battle though Oh no! Hang on. Okay, that wasn't fair. I got distracted by the vlog and lost. <laughs> Never mind. Mm, you looking forward to that? You want to go home? Yeah. We are heading home. I've had a lovely little evening. I am stuffed full of pizza. <laughs> it's a beautiful night. It's just started raining a little bit, actually. But well, like spitting. No, it's, this is not real rain. What's happening? I think it's stopped now, actually. No, it's because you're under a tree. Yeah, oh yeah, because <laughs> you're under a tree. It's not stopped. It's just spitting slightly. We've oh, just got chatting to this couple at the pizza place. It's starting to rain a little bit heavier now. Um, it's just gonna lash down in a second, I reckon. But yeah, got chatting to them, had a like a drink with them, and talking about their travel plans and stuff they're going they going down to Ho Chi Minh and then biking up, up to Cambodia like a seven day um biking thing with like 45 friends from back from England or something sounds oh yeah <laughs> sounds incredible so that was nice having a little chat with them for a little while I'm back at home now and so I'm gonna to be an idiot. I'm gonna end the vlog here because I'm probably just gonna get into bed and chill out or whatever. So thanks for watching today, our last little day in Hong Kong, I was gonna say. I have no idea why I was gonna say Hong Kong. But anyway, our last day in, where, where am I? Hoi An. Yes, our last day in Hoi An. We move on tomorrow. So thanks for watching. Hope you've had a wonderful day, whatever you've done. Idiot. See you guys. He's so in socks at the camera. See you guys tomorrow. Good night. <laughs> oh, <laughs> my face. That was my sweaty one in sock as well. Mm. <laughs>